What is going on? We got uh, Kershaw Bel Air today in Magna Cut. Uh, we're gonna try to look for a good place to to test this. I'll try to get the thumb studs off and stripped out my T6. So uh, I'm I'm guessing they Loctited it. So we're gonna what we're gonna do is we're gonna attempt to test it back here. We're gonna use that tester block in order to be able to do it. We just calibrated the machine, but let's check it anyway, uh, just because. The next block I get, I'm going to uh, go in a little line. Yeah. Just won't be spontaneous craters all in the block. Yeah, I didn't. Mean, smart. I didn't realize how expensive these son of a bitches were. But like every fucking thing else. <laughs> thanks to the members and Patreon for making the, these uh, rock load tests uh, possible. We use y'all's money to to buy new shit when we need it. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it makes videos. It does make videos. We very much appreciate the support. We're still at 63. I've got some curly stuff going on with my hair. We're actually like 62.75 or something like that. So take that information and do what you will with it. It's not bad enough that I'm going to recalibrate it. It's uh, reading just a little bit soft. Where's the Bel Air? What did I do? Okay, there it is. Okay, let's see what kind of magic we can work. With this, man. Lord have mercy. Probably none. My damn little nose. Uh, you heard her? Courtney stole this knife. As soon as it came in. I don't think that's going to work. Nope. It ain't. It's not. I tell you, it's half off, half off. Okay. We're going to have to go with the flattest of the flats. That we have to work with here. We may do this again eventually if we ever get these damn thumb studs off. But we're going with the uh, flattest portion of the knife that we have to work with. And this is supposed to be... According to Kershaw, 61 to 64. It's like 62. Uh, definitely going 64 63 63 is my number today okay holy shit 63 and a half 63 and a half and it's you know just to be you know completely transparent this is a full flat grind and that is at the top you know closest to the spine so no it's not a completely flat surface um, and I'm not going to poke 10 holes in the knife, but I will turn it around and we'll do it again on the other side to see where it, the number's falling. Might want to go back a little bit, like towards the back of the machine. There we go. Here. There we go. All right. Here we go. Tell it's not on a flat surface the way the needle the needle's spinning all the way all the way back. You know, oh, it's yeah. like it's it's not a completely flat. Not completely stable. But it's the flattest portion we have to work with. I we can disassemble the knife. We can test it again later. Ooh, but that stupid omega spin. You got it. You got all of it. <clears throat> Sixty three and a half again. So uh that's not a coated blade, that is just a dark stone wash. And hey, spicy. Uh, she said, she said good afternoon. Stacy did? Yeah. Oh, well, hey, Stacy. Good afternoon to you, too. <clears throat> you guys have a good one. And, uh, Courtney, you got anything to add? Nope. That's the Kershaw Bel Air and Magna Cut. And, like I said, uh, we may have a second test coming up, but that's it for now. That's what you get for now. You guys have a good one. We'll catch you on the flip side.